shorts. <laughs> yo, like the, the these anti gay reviewers ain't nothing but a bunch of dick riders, yo. Like they yo they yo yo these dudes are straight dick riding, yo. Yesterday was um you know, I guess like every Wednesday, all the anti gay community comes together and reads manga together, and they, they're quick to find the latest link to the next manga readings, and then they, they wake up at the crack of dawn to read it before everybody else, because I guess if I read it first, that means I'm cool, you know, I mean, like, and these pathetic anime gay reviewers, uh, you know, they, they sit here, they get up, it's quite pathetic if you ask me, and the thing that's pathetic, I, mean, I can see if they were in their, you know, 16s, 70s, I mean, these dudes are in their mid-20s, you know? Just pathetic. <laughs> Just straight dick riot in the anime community. And then when you watch that mediocre bullcrap, every single week it's the same exact thing. It's the same exact mediocre bullcrap, yo. I mean these I mean, I can see also I can see if the these these anagays that they wake up at six to five o'clock in the morning to read to the anime community, I can see if it, the if the chapters are actually progressing. They're not going anywhere. Each week they stop it right before anything happens. It's pathetic. And they're just... They're, <laughs> yo, you see... <laughs> this is popped in my head. You ever see that episode of the, the Bulldogs? Dick riding Obama, Obama. <laughs> Dick riding for today, hey. Dick riding for tomorrow. <laughs> This thing is a straight dick ride in the anime community. Yo, take the narrow cock out of your mouth, anime community. Cool nerds. I gotta be honest with you. Um. <laughs> Dick riding for, you know, that's funny. That's hilarious. I'm going to start saying that. Bunch of dick riders over there at the NDA community. Any, I mean, just dick riding reviews. Let's get off of that. Anywho, Full Metal Alchemist, Edward and his brother. I apologize if I don't know his brother. Oh, my God. You know what? This guy wants to be the new leader of the anime, anime, anime community. He doesn't even know the names of the characters. Listen, I don't want to be the leader of the anime community, all right? You know what I'm saying? I want to be the, the destroyer of the anime community and the uplifter. I'm like, uh, what you call that? The Phoenix? The, come, the Phoenix comes in and destroys, but then, you know, anyway, I'm off task. I'm off task. Anyhow, cool nerds. Uh, listen, I'm getting, you're probably saying, Zubi, why are you trolling us with these announcement videos? No, um, I am getting direct information from, in next month's Show and Jump magazine, I know the whole anime community is going to get it. Um... The, the, I'm giving you the announcement before they be announced. In the next month's Show and Jump magazine, <laughs> for the month of October or so, you will see these characters announced. Now, by all means, let's get serious. Um, you know, Full Man Alchemist, uh, when I was younger, I remember it used to come on Toonami. Um, and it was actors, actors, actually pretty interesting, you know? It's just that I never really took the time to sit down and, and got with it. I know it's on Netflix now, so I can I can go ahead and manually watch them. But you know, I got I just you know, things are just so chaotic and, and busy right now in my life and I'm very blessed to have a very busy life. Um it's just that, you know, when I get some free time I'm going to sit down and watch uh Full Metal Alchemist because I really do like the story. My sister, my older sister, loves Full Metal Alchemist. And you gotta understand my sister's not really she, you know, growing up, she wasn't really an anime person. She did like Dragon Ball Z. You know, she didn't really like it, but it was what it was. But my older sister isn't really into anime. And not until me and my baby sis got into it, uh, then she started... Really, she's more heavy into the anime more than I am. She watches all that junk on the on the Netflix. I can't watch having that, that product that's on the Netflix right now. But, she, you know, I'm just glad that she was able to find her own anime. You know, like, for me, it's Dragon Ball Z. For my baby sis, it would be, you know, it's so many. Uh, Sailor Moon, uh, you know, Soul Eater, I think it is. Uh, it's a lot of them, a lot of them. I don't want to get too do too to it. I just want to get directly to the point and to, uh, I want to talk directly to the JSR and, and Neko Bad Night and Showing Jump right now. Uh, and I'm glad that she was able to find her own anime and her own product, her own, you know, because some of these animes are actually in the spiritual. That's why I always say Dragon Ball Z is my Bible because there's something very spiritual about it. 
You know what I'm saying? And it really just uplifts me. If some of you guys, if you if you get spiritually attached to the bleaches and the fairy tales and the Naruto's, that's cool. I respect that 100%. But some of you are, you know, but it's not really like that for you guys. You guys are just a bunch of, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to get into it. I just want to get straight to, to the video. I want to get to my point. Now, and I'm very happy that my sister was able to, and she watched from episode one all the way through, and she asks me every week, have you watched Full Metal Alchemist? I love Full Metal Alchemist. And, you know, I'm very happy and I'm proud for her. Um, with that being said, I would like to add Edward and his brother to, 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 to the, the J-Star victory, uh, a character roster. I think it'd be, I think these guys are legends. They came up back in the day. Like I said, I seen the story. I thought it was very interesting. For what I seen that I was, that, that really connected with me was that they were willing to do anything and everything to revive their mother. I guess something happened to the mother. They try to do some alchemy. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm very into alchemy. Like I'm able to, alchemy is an aspect of, I'm able to take this and the gay community and I'm able to make it into something strong, something powerful and more, 10 times better than it ever was than any other of these guys with the 10 times and millions of subscribers who don't do nothing but cater to your meteorocracy. You know what I'm saying? And your meteorocracy your life. Me, I'm trying to perfect your life. I'm trying to get you guys more creative. I'm trying to get you guys more energized, get you guys pumped and really having a better life. And that's what I'm doing. Anyhow, I'm off task. So let me get back to the point so I can get done with this video. So we can move on with our days. Anywho, I would like to have uh, Edward and his brother, I apologize. I'm pretty sure somebody from the Anagate community is going to correct me and tell me what you can tell me because I would like to know the names. Um, I would love to have them in the game because in the aspect of, you know, I would love to play with my sister. It'll be something for that my, me and my sister can connect with. She can pick Edward. I can pick the, uh, the baby brother. Or I could pick Edward, she could pick the baby brother, and we can just, you know, dominate. If somebody's beating up on my sister in the corner, that's just going to bring this inner rage for me, and I'm just going to get on you. You know what I'm saying? Bam, 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 bam. Get up off my sister. Let's get it going. I heard it was three-on-three -three battles. I'm not sure. The Anagate community do, does tend to lie. I think it's just two-on-two -two battles. If it's two-on-two -two battles, the Edward and brother combination can be very cool. Very cool. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Because you know what I'm saying? You know, I, I, you know, before every battle starts, they had that little introduction. And they, yeah, yeah, bring it on. You know what I'm saying? I can really see Edward and then the brother coming in. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's get this thing started. You know what I mean? I think they'd be really pumping and popping. You know what I'm saying? Also, what I would like to see, if any aspects, if I, you know, if I don't mess with Edward and his brother, I would like to see somebody else rock with him. You know what I'm saying? Like, in the aspects of like, it'll just be mad cool to see an unbeatable force. These, 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 because in the anime, these are like the only two tag teams. It is some more tag teams that I will announce later in the earlier announcement of the video. But this is the two teams that I would like to see, like any aspects of like two cool nerds or two a brother, two brothers who are nice at video games or nice in J Star Victory to be able to really perfect and work with Ather to the aspect of the point like. You know, if I'm picking Goku and my partner might be Luffy or something, we're going to have to work mad hard to go up against these mother suckers because they're just straight dominating. They're doing all the tag team moves with the brothers. And I think it'd just be mad hot to see that. That'd be mad iconic. It'd be dope. And I would just applaud those people who were able to perfect those two in the aspects of something really cool to see. You know what I'm saying? That would be so cool to see, and I would really like to see it. Not in aspects of me, but I would like to go against uh, Edward and his brother in the aspect of, like, y'all really want to fight these dudes. These dudes are representing, and I promote you on my channel 100%. Cooters, like I said, this will be a go-to channel for entertainment. You know, there will be no dick riding here. You know, there will be, there will be no dick riding Obama here. 100% entertainment. These other channels are just catering to your sensitive side. By all means, that's good. But here, we're just here to have fun. If you're willing to have fun with me and the gay community, I'm willing to have fun with you. No homo. Some of the, you know, monkey, some of the other gays got a little exactly what I said. <laughs> you you, you want to have fun with us up? Let, relax, you know. <laughs> Anywho, tomorrow, tomorrow's video, I think we're going to do a question and answering. Uh, I'm gonna, you know, I really don't like people in my personal space. I don't like people in personal business, but I think we can do a quest. Come on, you do a quest next. Yeah, we can do a quest next tomorrow. 
Um, Monkey's not even over there, but I'm just talking to somebody. I don't even know where Monkey is. I lost him in between this, this, the gunk and goo between my room. But anyway, tomorrow's the question and answer. It is what it is. Don't forget to ask me on, on, on Cool Nerds, uh, on Twitter. Add me on the Xbox, uh, the Monkey King. I don't have access, but listen, I'll go into it tomorrow, man. We, we don't have all day on this, Monkey. We don't have all day, okay? We need to get this video pumping and popping, then we move on to the next thing. I really want to see the Anakin community picking up on uh, Edward and his brother. I think it'd be really fun, Monkey. You know what I'm saying? It'd be really fun. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs>